what's up everybody welcome back to my channel be me bad muscle up in your face in your screens how you guys doing how is nigeria treating you wherever you are in the world how are you guys doing good afternoon where whenever you get to see this video at whatever time you are watching this video god i'm rambling what's up you guys hope you guys are well um today i'm just here with this quick chit chat video is it chit chat yeah somewhat chit chat -cha. anyways just here real quick to just share the most requested video on my channel is it the most requested i don't think it's the most requested i just i just think a lot of people ask but i don't think it's the most requested i get a lot of dms asking this question but today Sha, i shall said that i will talk about it because i feel like i don't like talking about that part of my life but you know what everybody learns from one thing or the other you guys always ask me what are the things that i use and take as a lady with pcos and things like that ever since i came out here to share my pcos journey with you guys and you know i got pregnant i have an adorable daughter who is going to be four in a couple of months and um, i shared that i was diagnosed with pcos several years ago and i thought i would not be able to have children but god had greater plans for my life <laughs> and then since then i get a lot of dms several times just asking one question or the other and because i'm not a doctor and i'm not a pro at this thing i just always feel the need not to address it because i'm not a doctor and i don't want somebody to quote me and say it's beaming that said that we should do like this no i didn't want that but today guys i'm going to be sharing with you some of the supplements and the things that i use um Pretty much for my body if you're interested just keep watching so yes like i said earlier several years ago I was diagnosed with pcos hormonal imbalance things like that yada 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 and um i pretty much been living with it it has its ups and downs it's a struggle it's a it's a journey it's a, something you have to deal with but it does not define my life it does not define our lives um it causes obesity in some people which is part of the reasons why i'm on the chubby side um we have to live healthy will have a balanced diet eat better drink lots of water exercise but then some people will say don't exercise too much they will say cardio is too if cardio is too much for pcos people it's a problem if cardio is too little it's a problem i don't even know the one that they want but we try to do what we can do i take walks i do all of that um i try to drink water i try to drink water keyword try because i know that it's very important for my body um and then i try to eat a balanced diet i try to also to do intermittent fasting i do that just to you know be on this weight loss journey so that i can fight and kick pts in the butt like as he's doing it like this i'll be doing my own back fighting back basically anyway so today i'm just here to share some of the supplements that i use to just maintain my body and things like that so first of all we're going to start with Ovacetol. this is what it looks like um Ovacetol is pretty much just a brand of inositol and this is the inositol blend 40 ratio one you have to be specific that is 40 ratio one and it's pretty much just like in a powdery form um it has a scoop inside you scoop like one table one of the scoops and put it inside a cup of water and you drink it with your we just gulp i just gulp it down basically some people say you can drink it with juice or whatever i don't do that i just put a put a scoop inside water every morning and i drink it every morning and every evening i forget the evening part i will not even lie to you but it's supposed to be every morning and every evening um and then i just go about my day so the inositol blend is supposed to help me with my uh, menstrual cycle because with pcos we have irregular menstrual cycles and since i had my daughter it's just gone downward spiral like you see this month, you not see next month, you not see for several months. But um, since I started using Ovacetol consistently, let me say keyword consistently, um, I've been seeing changes in my, you know, period and all that great stuff. So yeah, this is something that you could try out. Ask your doctor first though, please. That's the reason why I've no one to make all these videos all these years. I beg, don't say that it is baby that said you should use it. So ask your doctor first, do your research before you decide to use this. You can also check out the PCOS Cheek on instagram i'll leave her and do somewhere here that's where i get great resources she also sells this because this is not so easy to come by i got this all the way in abuja and i had i had it sent to me in lagos so it's not i'm I've, I've, I've i'm yet to see somewhere in lagos where they sell this so it's not something that you can easily come by so check out the pcos chiksha tell i sent you okay so the second thing i use is this gia herbs vitex berry this is what it looks like vitex berry 
basically just take um one capsule a day this is supposed to help you balance your hormones and also help you boost fertility you know if you want to get pregnant and things like that like i said earlier ask your doctor before you use it to have it okay so another supplement that i use um is this vitamin e and i use this nature plus brand it's quite an expensive brand um if anybody knows a somewhat cheaper brand for this vitamin e please let me know this one is kind it's costly anyway so i use this vitamin e it also helps to boost fertility it helps with, to regulate ovulation it helps for you to ovulate basically because i know that some of the things with hormonal imbalance is that you may not even be ovulating or you may not be ovulating at the right time so this helps with your ovulation helps improve um, your fertility boost fertility if you want to have children um and i i'm a strong believer of even if you want to have you want to start having kids maybe in two years time or whatever start using this even if you and your husband are trying to wait or things like that um start using using this if you're a single lady you're already um, engaged to be married in a couple of months or years or whatever um and you know you want to have kids immediately you get into your relationship or in it, immediately you get into your marriage i would strongly advise to start taking um vitamin e um so that just that your body will start getting ready for things like that sha. but like i said earlier again ask your doctor before you use it please don't quote me i'm just sharing with you what you guys asked me and these are the things that i use so another supplement that i use is this um ephemal pure evening primrose oil and this is what it looks like it's pretty much just one capsule a day in the morning that I use. Um, it just, first off, this helps with my skin. So you put out the same, the glow, the glow, the glow. I don't wear makeup, you guys know that. Um, I just do my skincare. Um, but you know that like you're supposed to also help your skin from within. So I use this, it helps me um with this glue that you're seeing Sha, it helps with my skin so another reason why i use it besides my skin is that it increases something called or improves the quality of something called the cervical mucus which is pretty much um when the mucus that helps your the sperm the man's sperm to find your eggs so it increases the quality of the man's sperm finding your eggs on time to fertilize and things like that and it also helps with fertility basically bottom line it helps with fertility Sha. so that's another reason why i use this and the last but not the least that i use is well woman max so there's well there are regular well woman products um i feel like every lady once you're above the age of 30 don't quote me i'm just saying this i think you should start using some type of vitamins um because all the food that you might be eating may not contain all the essential vitamins for your body so if you um if you speak so if you speak to your doctor and your doctor gives you the go ahead to get well woman i think that as a woman you should start using things like this they help you with your skin they help you with your um immune system to boost your immune system basically also helps with your skin um and it's pretty much one one a day all this all these capsules and things that you just use just to help you especially like i said if you have hormonal imbalance or you have pcos and things like that and you're trying to get pregnant and another thing that i don't have yet i also use from time to time is apple cider vinegar and i don't use it for weight loss like people say i just use it as a how do I explain it? So when I drink it, it helps me feel fuller. Um, so for people like us that are foodies that, you know, we're always feeling hungry and all that. So it just helps me feel fuller. That way I'm not um, hungry all the time and I want to eat and things like that. I think, I think Ovacetol actually does something like that for me too. Or maybe it's because I use it in the morning before I even step out of my house. So I can't, because you, you're using it with water or I'm using it with water, um, it makes my tummy feel fuller. So I'm not hungry and, you know, wanting to nibble on something or snack on something so those are the things that i pretty much use um that helps me um also i realized that since i started using these things especially like the well woman um my mood has drastically changed like i no longer have terrible mood swings that i used to have um i'm now more lively more you know i'm more jovial with people i'm not um taking people for granted you know i'm not snapping at people in my house and things like that and i know that with hormonal imbalance and things like that you get to be moody you get to be weak you get to snap at people all around you pretty much having 
having mood swings but i realized that my mood has drastically changed since i started using especially that well woman so yeah um those are the things that i use i also have to say that um if you are trying to conceive um you're trying to get pregnant i would also advise that you get ovulation test strips i said this before in old videos and i will continue to say it i also have ovulation test strips because with pcos um those apps that we have on our phones don't necessarily cannot necessarily predict when you're going to be ovulating or when your period is going to come so yes they can try and try and try but they may not get the exact thing but then you also it's also a gauge i use those apps but then they also help me gauge like around the period the time where the ovulation might start or when the period might come or things like that so i use my test strips to actually measure to see oh am i ovulating am i not ovulating because sometimes it feels like you're ovulating but you're not and then you use those test strips and they tell you no you're not ovulating or you if you don't think you're ovulating and you use the test strips and they actually say you're ovulating so you need to also be able to keep track of things like that um like i said earlier eat eat a healthy balanced diet and all in all pray to god like it's only god that can help us sustain this phase of our lives and it's only god that can grant you like the desires of your heart so all in all at the end of the day you also have to pray to god it's very very important and just um know that your body is the temple of the lord and whatever the devil is trying to come throw at you it's not going to work in jesus name amen all right so that's those are the things that i use for my body if you use any of them please let me know if they've worked for you did you experience any side effects um if there are other things that you use um as someone with pcos or hormonal imbalance please let me know leave it in the comment section down below and i would like to read it <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching this video please ignore that my daughter was here the entire time disturbing us <laughs> she's i don't know what she thinks she She's, what are you doing? You're filing your nails. She's filing her nails. <laughs> All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. You want to say bye? Yes. You, I know you want to say bye. 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 Wait, wait, wait. Bye. Okay. Bye. See you in the next one. See you in the next one. Okay. <laughs> bye, guys.